literally sold out. Uh, thank you all for coming. You, you'll see tonight uh, that the, the students have worked extremely hard on this production of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. They've been a, an exhilarating and uh, spirited cast from the moment that we started, and I know tonight uh, they will not disappoint me or anybody. Um, one thing I'd like to mention is if you do have to leave at any point during the show, please wait for the appropriate time to do it, which is on a scene change, is when the lights all go down and it's a blackout. Uh, please don't leave during a scene. It's very distracting to the audience and to other actors. And of course, please turn off all of your cell phones and beepers and palm pilots and alarm watches. <laughs> Anything else? Uh, and I guess that's all, all uh, that I have. Um, Marno, was there anything? Nope, that was it. Enjoy the show. Thanks for coming. Please be patient. <laughs> uh, are you sure you have one? What's the date? Yeah. 
Augustus, Augustus, I don't think you had better do that. No soup, roast beef, and blueberry pie. <laughs> but you can have almost anything you want. What do you mean by that? If you were to start chewing it, you would actually taste all of those things. <laughs> and it satisfies you, it fills you up. It's terrific. That's utterly impossible. Just so long as it's gum and I can chew it, then that's for me. Come on, Mr. Wonka, hand over this magic gum of yours, and we'll see if this thing is really worth Now, Violet, let's not do anything silly. What's so silly? I want the gum. I actually would rather you didn't take it. You know, it still has a few kinks that I have to work out. Oh, the heck with that. You know how they first have eaten up with their knuckles? To be sure it's not a bad one. If it's bad, it makes a hollow sound and they don't bother to open it. They simply throw it down the garbage chute. Thank <laughs> you.